everybody. My name is Lynn Ismael, and I live in southwestern Ontario, zone 6A to, well, zone 6A slash 5B, not 2. Today, I'm going to attempt to plant the bulbs that I've purchased for spring 2023 flower show. No, there's no flower show, just floral show, just for my own garden, for my own enjoyment. Um, I chose daffodils and alliums because my garden is full of rabbits. You know how rabbits are, they just, they just do stuff. Anyway, I want to welcome wildlife, but not too welcome that they'll eat the rest of my garden. So I chose bulbs that A, will resist rabbits and B, multiply eventually in the future. I mean, I do enjoy tulips, but if I have to plant tulips, they'll have to be within my fenced area and I'm saving that prime spot for my cold season, cold hardy flowers. And um, and yeah, and they're, they're treated like animals. They don't normally come back with the same power year after year. Unless you buy a, buy a Darwin type, Darwinian Darwin type tulips. You see how uh, how versed I am when it comes to tulips. Not much. So let's. Uh, I've got two boxes here. One's from Bessie's big box. <laughs> and uh, a bag from my favorite nursery. Northland Nursery up in somewhere between Hamilton and Cambridge. I keep uh, <laughs> I keep forgetting the name of the town. I think it's Mooreville or no Melgrove. That's right, Melgrove. Anyway, let's uh, let's open these up, shall we? <laughs> So far, here's what we have. I have six of Fritillaria Maxima. I have uh, two sets of 25 of Allium Ceruleum, which is a blue, blue Allium. I have three sets of three of Allium Red Mohican. Two sets of Allium Drumstick, sets, two sets of 25, so there's 50 there. Uh, I ordered two sets of Allium Miami, but they apparently, um, Northland Nursery ordered a thousand, but their supplier just gave them a hundred. So I'm lucky to get a set of 25. So thank you, Northland. So Allium Miami, set of 25, so 25 bulbs there. And I have one gold master allium, one set of three. So let's see how my math is. So you have three plus 25 is 28 plus 50, 78 plus 9, 87, 88. Okay, my math is not working today. Um, I'll call you later. On to my Bessies. Alright, the Bessies box. Now, I received this on Monday. Um, they typically want me to open the box right away when they uh, when they arrive. But um, it's easier. Okay, I wasn't sure You're supposed to open it as soon as you um, as soon as you receive it in the mail, but um, I thought it'd be much nicer if I open it outside and 
lighting is much better well, for YouTube. Okay. This is mostly. I can take that to town to walk them. All right. Okay. So, throw my quarters. These are nice and packed. Um, maybe we'll look to the time lapse again because uh, otherwise this might take a while. Them in, I planted a few in the fall last year. In the spring, I really enjoyed seeing something blue, something bright blue in the garden after a long, long period of snow. And after snow, just lucky. But, so yeah, blue. I enjoy blue, so I'm getting more. I'm getting some. Um, I also planted these daffodil gardenias. I've got five. Ordered more. No, I guess I'll just order one. Uh, three sets of three, so nine total of Allium Purple Sensation. It's another blue bulbous plant. Uh, I was surprised they're surprisingly very fragrant. Well, I mean, not fragrant, but you can smell from afar, but once you like smush your face into the flower, it's quite a nice, pleasant smell. And the bees love them. So I bought more. I have five of the Daffodil Joy Spirit. Um, it's a white daffodil, single layer with some orange in the middle. Two Hallias, Hallia, fragrant Hallia. I mean, the name, if you like Mexican soap operas, because Back in the Philippines, we had this uh, soap opera called Marimar, which is a Mexican telenovela that's been translated into Tagalog. The main actress's name, real name, is Talia, and she's still around, I think. And that's what made me think of, uh, of her. So I'm thinking of planting this under my willow tree. Hey, old ones. I have two of uh, Daffodil Sweet Ocean. Uh, so 10 in total. I have two packs of 10, so 20 um, Galanthus albicii. Oh, it's not a daffodil, it has no drop. So I'm excited about that. My friend Jane um, loves snowdrops. So I planted a few in my garden last year. I think this is a different, um, different variety. This one should be bigger. So once I got growing in the garden was like this more like four inches. And this is supposed to go up to ten. Let's see. And if I have two packs of eight under beauty. Oh no. One is smooshy. Anyway, um, here we go. 
thanks for indulging me on sharing my fall borders for this fall and hopefully the rat, the rat, not rabbits, the squirrels won't take them up and then I can uh, show you what they look like in the spring. Alright, bye! So let's review what I got here. I have a uh, hundred of muscari. Okay, stop moving. Stop moving. Here, I have three sets of purple sensation. Hmm. Sorry if my thing keeps moving. Let me do that again. Alright, well now you're not moving. <laughs>